Hello Aquarius, welcome to my channel. My name is Isabel from the Tarot Empress.com. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'm going to be doing your tarot card reading now for the month of September 2019. So I'm just quickly shuffling the cards to find out what's going to be happening for your love life. And this is going to be providing you with a general overview and then we're going to be getting into the reading, okay? Okay, so what I see from the cards is an indication in this situation that, you know, some of you are looking for answers and looking for a way to find happiness. I feel like with a specific person, you had something really good going on, okay? And you might have been married to this person, sharing a home with them, or wanting to start a family and, you know, moving in together. It might have been one of the key things that you were looking forward to. But what I'm sensing is that, you know, this might have came to an end, or perhaps the two of you were together and then it just didn't work out and you're dealing with some difficulties and challenges at this point of time. Now... I see here that you are looking for answers, you're looking for the way to go out of the situation into a more positive sort of scenario where you can have happiness with this individual. Currently the energies are, you know, indicating a lot of challenges, difficulties of that nature. You might be feeling like, why is this happening, you know? What's the purpose of this? So let's find out. So your energy is indicating to me that you know in your heart that this person is the one for you. You know that, you know, if things come together in the right manner, both of you and this individual can have something fabulous. I do feel like, you know, something's making you feel very emotional right now. Maybe, you know, you're not getting that communication or momentum that you would like from the situation. Maybe things are just not panning out the way you wanted for it to occur. Now, I feel like you're pinning a lot of hopes in this person. You really want to be with them. You can't see yourself with anybody else. You know, you're constantly thinking about them, wondering, you know, what's happening in this specific situation. Let's have a look at their energy. I see that this person, you know, they are trying to be as patient as possible. They're trying to look on the bright side. They feel like, you know, in time, everything will get solved. They also feel like, you know, if they're just patient, if they just allow for things to, you know, happen on its own pace, things will get resolved. But I feel like they're holding back when it comes to either talking to you or, you know, doing something that needs to be done. They're either taking their time in doing it and... Um, what I'm sensing is that there's something you want of this person and something that they're not delivering and it's causing a difficulty in terms of the relationship. I definitely pick up that there's a bit of, uh, you know, an emotional distance between the two of you. How you're looking at the situation is very different to how they're looking at it and um, I do feel like you have a lot of hope that, you know, this person is going to come through for you. But I feel like they're taking a bit of a lackadaisical approach, like they're just wanting, you know, for things to fall into place and the time is right, you know, everything will be fine. It's that sort of attitude. But from these cards, what I'm seeing is that that attitude is going to get the two of you nowhere slowly, okay? And you don't want to be in a situation where, you know, you know that if this person just does what you want or does what you're hoping that they do, that things will change. But I don't feel like they're going to be budging. So what can you do in this situation, okay?
So I feel like you have been having a lot of sleepless nights about this, okay? And I feel like this individual, though they want to take a bit of a slow approach in the situation, they are, you know, growing a little bit impatient as well about what is going on here. I feel like you want things to move forward and you want it to be rapid, but, you know, the tarot cards are indicating that too much energy at your desired, you know, pace might be energy wasted or might cause you to have a migraine or a headache. What you want now is to sort of change the way you're looking at the situation. I get the impression that even though this person, you know, wants things to fall into place and, you know, wants to take their time, they're also growing impatient and they could be hiding that from you and you might not be able to see that, that this individual wants things to change. And, you know, judging from where the situation is leading, I'm seeing more challenges just because the two of you are not on the same page. You know, the two of you are not clicking together in the way that you are supposed to click as a couple. So I'm going to be reshuffling the tarot cards now and having a look at the energies again, just to get a little bit more information for you guys. Your energy is ready for that change, okay? And I see that you're ready to do whatever it takes. You know, you're willing to put everything on the line in order to restore this relationship to the proper state that it was meant to be in. And I'm picking up enthusiasm from your energy and picking up willingness to do, you know, whatever it takes. Let's have a look at their energy. Okay, so what I see from this individual's energy is something that might surprise you. Even though they would like for things to move forward in the way that you want, they either are having you know, some sort of paranoia or insecurity in terms of having that happiness and stability that they really crave in their life, okay? So this leaves you in a bit of a dilemma because this individual, you know, next to your energy is indicating to me that there's this fractured situation where both of you want the same thing, but both of you have your own sort of uh, path towards it. And that's why the two of you are not meeting in the middle. So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be looking extensively at your energy and the energy of the individual that you're dealing with for the month of September 2019. It's going to be a monthly tarot card reading, okay? So it's going to cover a lot of things that you might be unaware of, okay? You can find the links in the description box below if you want a personal reading. You can get it at thetarotempress.com. Have a wonderful day and take care.